hello everyone welcome back it's a marks and spencers haul this week i love doing these marks and spencers hauls this is actually sponsored with marks and spencers and thanks to you lovely ladies the last one was really popular so they've asked me to do another i've chosen a lot of really good spring summer staple pieces in here there's one item that I'm totally in love with and all of this on here apart from one pair of jeans came to £300. Now that's a lot of clothing for £300 I think from Marks and Spencers and I'm really pleased with all of it. Please let me know in the comments what your favourite item is, I'd love to hear. And for reference, I'm a size 10 and I'm 5 foot 2, so I'm on the petite side, definitely. I will add all the sizes of what I'm wearing through, throughout the film. And yeah, a couple of pieces I've bought in petite as well this time. See how the leg lengths go, ladies. But yeah, I'm over the moon with everything that's on here. So let's crack on. I'm going to share with you what I'm wearing today and I just thought being as it's a Marx's haul I wanted to share this staple piece that I've worn so much from the last haul that I did and it's this white ribbed roll neck top I've worn it so much I normally wear it as a layering piece with a cardigan over or a jumper I've worn it under dresses it's just been a great piece and the quality is absolutely excellent I've paired it with my boot cut, I think these are the Eva boot cut jeans. These were a size 10, the top is a size 10. I've paired it with a plain leather navy belt. I've got pearl earrings in today because I think it goes nice with the white. And white really lifts your face, doesn't it? It really adds a little bit of brightness, which I think is good. I've got my Nord Green watch on and Monica Veneda bracelet you've seen this hundreds of times I've had this for about eight years now it's not tarnished at all really really pleased with it and yeah don't forget I've got a discount code as well so all my discounts will be listed um right so let's crack on I'm going to show you the favorite piece first and it's this navy dress it honestly this hanging on the hanger it's not doing it justice at all so it's like a jersey material if you remember I've got the black jersey tea dress as well from Marx's um, it's a little bit big for me at the moment I've bought this in a 10 and I think I could have maybe done with an 8 let's have a look no I've bought this in a 12 petite and I think I could have done with a 10 petite but I still love it. Um, this is £35, this dress. So you've got a whole outfit apart from your accessories for £35. I just think it's absolutely beautiful. It's a Bardo style shoulder. And on the shoulder you've got this ruching. I don't know if you can see that. And it just helps that shoulder piece stay right where it should be I've noticed this a lot with these new Bardo styles that they you know you throw hoik in your top you don't have to with this because you've got this elasticated ruching I think it's a great idea it's a very lightweight jersey type material three quarter sleeves you've got an a line going down asymmetrical is that I think that's right and yeah it just adds a really nice finishing touch to the dress this this is going to be great just to wear in the in the warmer months I think as a casual piece with a pair of sliders or sandals I think espadrilles will look really good or I think you could really jazz this up for an evening as well I was actually thinking about maybe clipping a couple of earrings you know here and here to make it like an evening piece I think you could do that as well where you know just your accessories will jazz this up a great piece for 35 pounds well and truly over the moon 
Right, next, let's get into these jeans that I've been recommended. So many of you have mentioned these to me. These are the Lily Slim. I've got these in a tight size 10 short. And they look lovely on the model. They are not skinny, but they are slim. Perfect type of jean for me. If these are right, I'll be getting these in every colour. This is your great casual look, isn't it? A nice, easy to wear pair of slim jeans. They've got plenty of stretch in them. Yeah, loads of stretch in there. I hope they hold the tummy in. Pockets to the back. There's not a lot to them. They're quite a basic pair of jeans. But yeah, that's what I wanted. I love the colour wash of these ones as well. I think these are £25. I think that's really good for a pair of jeans, to be fair. Now, I've got a lot of basic tops because this is what I'm short of, the basic layering pieces. We're coming into blazer season now, aren't we? And I've got so many blazers, I love to wear them. If I remember rightly, last year, it went from cold to really hot really quick and it was like blazer season just went out the window. So I'm hoping I'm going to get some wear out of them this year. I've got this blue slash neck three quarter length sleeved t-shirt and I didn't have one in navy and again it's going to be a great layering piece this will work under any blazer with these jeans it's just a nice casual but smart outfit I think and then I ordered this one this patterned one now Marxies have got a lot of these on the website and I, you know, they're cheap as chips. How much was this one? £8.50, this t-shirt. And I, I love the pattern on it. Can you see all those colours in there? So that's going to pair up with your light blue, your white, your navy. Um, yeah, I really liked it. I do think it runs a little small. This is a size 10. And I do think it's a small 10 ladies it fits me fine i've tried it on but i just thought i'd let you know that i think this should be sized up so yeah but for eight pound fifty you can get a smart look out of that now linen i'm always collecting linen for the summer this is a beautiful piece it's an oversized white linen shirt it was the front detail that really caught my eye this uh what would you call that it's like a it's it's like a lace detail really really lovely it's very oversized i got this in a size 10 and i could have done with a size 8 in this you've got a slight puff on the sleeve it's a really really pretty piece again um you could wear this as a layering piece with a vest top, great for a holiday, not tucked in, just nice and loose, or tuck it in with a shirt. And that detail really stands out. It's beautiful, beautiful. This is £39.50. This is one of the pricier items. And this is linen. So yeah, not, not a bad price for that, I don't think. It does actually say, does actually say in the label that it is a long line shirt. 55% flax linen and the rest is cotton. It's, it feels lovely. This is going to be great for the hot weather, I think. You know, I don't like getting burnt. I don't like too much heat on my body. So this is what I'll be wearing as a cover up, I think. Yeah, lovely, lovely piece. Then I chose this cardigan and it's a really weighty cardigan, I will say that. It's a size small, £27.50, but I love the pattern. And as you know, ladies, I'm always collecting my neutrals and I just thought this would be a lovely staple piece to go with all my neutrals. We're still having some chilly days, aren't we? So. A white t-shirt under this I think is going to be excellent. I could even wear it with, over the top of this roll neck to be fair. 
it really is a lovely piece excellent quality i think this is cotton 27 pound 50 and i've got this in a size small but yeah nice detail on there you've got a little tiny cuff it's like your real old-fashioned style cardigan it's going to go with everything isn't it because it's neutral that's why i chose it i think i'm going to get a lot of wear out of this one Next I chose another dress, this is a size 10, size 10 petite I've gone for in this one. It really caught my eye on the website, it's not something that I would normally go for, these loud stripes, but I loved this detail here at the waist. This seems to be a real trend at the moment, I'm seeing a lot of middle of the waist statement designs. This actually pulls in, so that's good. I love the puff sleeves. You know, I love the puff sleeve ladies, but not frilly. They're not frilly, so I can get away with that. A nice V-neck, and you've got this gathering detail here as well. To the back, it's the colour, I think, that did it for me. I really like the colour. You've got one tier on this one. So if you imagine this with sandals, espadrilles, it's a real beautiful holiday piece, I think, and quite a statement piece as well. I've not tried this on yet, but I, I think it's going to be a real winner. I really do. Now this caught my eye. These denim skirts with the splits up the front have been so popular, haven't they? And I've not got a denim one, not not a blue one, but I spotted this and I thought I will wear that a lot. It's going to pair with all my staple pieces that are neutral and yeah, it's really nice. Responsibly sourced cotton with stretch. This is a size 10 short and it's £29.50. And what I liked about this is that the split isn't right up to the thigh, like a lot of them are. I think I'm a little bit long in the tooth for that trend, but I'll be partly trendy because it's halfway. So I'm really happy about that. And that's what I liked about this skirt. It's just an on-trend piece, but not too on-trend that you feel too old to wear it. Yeah, my legs are not that good. But again, cream cream denim it's just one of my favorites and to go with that this caught my eye I thought I know I'll get a lot of wear out of that look at the colors in here I think it's navy brown pink and white and then you've got this lovely pink edging at the neckline I almost probably have one of those undone when I wear it it just gives it a more casual look just to have that little one button popped open yeah a really nice piece it's um a ribbed t-shirt this one it's a very very fine ribbing and excellent quality again this was 15 pounds it's a little bit dearer this one i know i'm going to get a lot of wear out of this i'll wear it with the navy denim i can wear it with white uh browns i think it's going to pair very well with this with the skirt so you've got your beige denim yeah it just caught my eye I like the colorways in it right in search of the navy trousers now I found these and they haven't they have got an elasticated back but they haven't got a ruched elasticated back do you remember I've complained about that big bulk of elastic that Marxists tend to do on some of their trousers and I really don't like that look but I spotted these I watched the film because you can watch films of the models wearing things on Marxists now and I think it's a really good style guide and I thought these these are lovely they look like a really lovely cut now these are the slim ankle grazers and I think I've got these in short or petite yeah size 10 short and they're 35 pounds you got side pockets they're a very dark navy i will say 
The only thing is we don't have belt loops. You know I like to wear my belts, ladies, but if the fit's really good, I'll sacrifice that. You've got a little split at the side here, and I've tried these on, and the length is perfect, and I'm really happy with them. These weren't expensive either. £35. The material's weighty. It's good quality material. The tailoring looks good. So we'll see in the try-on. Could this be the pair of navy trousers? You've got a back pocket here. Just one. Yeah, lovely style. Really pleased with those. I think this t-shirt will look good with those. I think this t-shirt will also look good. The white shirt will look good. So it's all, all of these items are gonna pair together quite well, I think. I'm really happy. Yes, quite excited about these. If I like these, I'll be getting other colors as well. This is the most expensive piece in the whole. I absolutely love it. I've tried it on and if you remember in London, I think it was last year, I tried this blazer on and I fell in love with it and it's been calling me ever since and I thought I'm going to get that casual blazer and that's exactly what it is, a really smart but casual blazer. Sometimes when you put a real tailored blazer on, you can go out and feel a little bit too formal i wanted something that i can throw on with my other neutral pieces again neutral this is going to go with everything um but it's the material of this that just really pairs it down that little bit it's like a waffle material and it's single breasted so you get that more casual look from the blazer it's got a slight shoulder padding i absolutely love it I think I, I know well I know I'm going to be wearing this a lot it's just going to go over my dresses my summer dresses when it's a bit cooler jeans it's just going to be a really good piece I've got my Marks and Spencer's jeans out I've had these a couple of years but look you pair any t-shirt with that and it's a nice outfit for say shopping you know meeting your friends for lunch you can wear jeans and a t-shirt, put this over the top and you just elevated that little bit more without looking over the top. It's a really, really lovely jacket. This is a size 10. It's £59. Pricey but worth every penny, ladies. It's lined. I love it. Really pleased with it. And then last... A new striped t-shirt. Now, I love a Breton tee and I haven't got any with the stripes wide apart and this caught my eye and I thought, yep, yeah, I'm going to go for that because again, it's going to be a great layering piece with my jeans and maybe a blazer or a different style jacket. Yeah, just a nice, easy to wear piece. Again, this is £9.50. I got this in a size 12. I didn't want it to be too clingy. It's most probably going to be a little bit oversized on me but I prefer it that way with jeans I just want to be comfortable yes £9.50 striped front and back just a really good basic key piece I think you can't go wrong with it So that's it ladies i hope you enjoyed that again don't forget to let me know what your favorite item is and yeah i love to hear i love to hear what your favorite is let me know what your least favorite is and thank you to you all for sticking by me else we wouldn't be getting this haul out today i'm so happy with all these pieces you're going to be seeing them a lot a lot anyway Thanks for watching. Please give a thumbs up, ladies, so more people get to see this film. I'm always begging for that extra thumbs up. And, yeah, if you really like the film, please subscribe. I'd love to hear from you as well. 
Until then, love to you all. I'll see you in the next one.